jacuzzi. Hey, today's gonna be a good day, buddy. And I got a good feeling about today. I do. Good morning, everybody. I think today's the day that I'm gonna go for a walk. Please, <laughs> hopefully. Uh, we've been sitting outside of the new shop now for this is day five of having a sore back and I've been resting, icing, heating my back, resting, doing everything I think I need to do, stretching and everything, but standing hasn't been an option for a while. I got up and moved around a little bit yesterday with a couple of crutches that I have here, and I'm hoping today's the day that we can bounce out of here and not squat in front of the new shop. I don't wanna be here anymore. I want a different view. That would make me really, really happy. Even if we can get out of here and go to like the local campground or something like that where it's a bit more naturey and you know you, you get it it's been the same view for too long but you don't care do you you just like i don't care dad as long as the heater's blowing at my belly that's all that matters hey buddy good morning pal oh but i stink because having a shower right now is not an option a little bit of clone and deodorant <laughs> that's my answer that's a good one. This is Dolce & Gabbana, the one. Uh, it's the perfume one. It's really, 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 really nice. It looks like it might be an okay day today. A little bit sunny, a little bit cloudy. I think Shane's coming here first thing this morning. Shane messaged me last night. I guess he caught the late ferry over here and he's gonna pop by here this morning. Um, and then Chris is coming by later this morning, I think. And I'm not sure what ferry Chris is catching. He's coming over from the Sunshine Coast. Then, uh, then we're out of here, guys. Is there any chance Daddy can have a piece of that floor, buddy? Any chance? I'm gonna take some of that heat from my back now, buddy. I've been icing my back in the bed, and then when I need heat, I come down here and sit on the floor and point my, point my heater at my back. It actually works quite nicely, actually. Uh, so you guys are getting this video in real time. It's 6.13 in the morning on April 10th. You guys are getting this video today. Before we get into showing you guys all the work that's been done up there, let's dive into the sponsor of today's video, which makes all of this new shop magic happen. Today's video is sponsored by AG1. AG1 is a foundational nutritional supplement that makes sure that I get my baseline nutrition in every day. Like there was a time when you'd have to take all these supplements from multiple different sources. Not anymore. It's all packed in right here in one easy, convenient way to slide in your nutrition every single morning. It says right there on the back of the package, AG1 has 75 vitamins, minerals, and nutrients and whole food source ingredients made for just about everybody we all know we got to get in our vitamins every single day and I don't want to take no pills forget that idea seriously eight ounces of water and that's it mm. I like to make it with a little less water just to bring out that flavor and for my gut health it has pre and probiotics and digestive enzymes to ensure that everything in here stays healthy and for focus and energy, it's got B vitamins and magnesium. And for my immune system, it's got vitamin C, zinc, and functional mushrooms. Daily support for energy, immune system, gut health, digestion, liver function, hormonal function, your brain. And doesn't have all this stuff on your No gluten, no GMOs, no dairy, no corn, no animal products. I want to thank AG1 for sponsoring today's video. And if you guys want to level up your nutrition game, click the links down below or scan the QR code on the screen right now. And they're offering you a free welcome pack, which features a canister, a shaker, five travel packs for your convenience, and also a one year supply of vitamin D3 plus K2. Thanks to AG1 for sponsoring today's video. Cruzy, your little nosy is dry. We gotta put some stuff on your nose, bro. There you go, buddy. a little nose butter let's show you some of the progress that has been happening upstairs over the last couple of days it's rolling already let's go let me take you guys you to paradise the door. You the door open. okay let's find out Well, 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 
There you have it, Chrome. Beautiful. Surprise, surprise. And then you see, sir, look at the, the flooring. Really nicely done. Just this one needs to be put on. You need to clean all the stairs. Well, 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 there we go, there we go, that was freaking awesome. Hey, look at me go. Doing good. Dude, that actually feels okay. This uh, is one of the two, that's the key. The double support? Yeah. Okay, mm, let's go upstairs. Oh yeah, oh yeah, look at that. Not quite, but I think we're good enough to move out of this spot anyway. I don't think we need to squat in front of the shop anymore, but not quite standable yet. I thought that was gonna be better news, buddy. I seriously did. In scenarios like these, I feel super thankful that I live in a van so I can park it in a place where I can have help. Whether you know, you're in a situation like me and you're parked at a city park, I guarantee it if you open up your side door and said excuse me to somebody walking by they'd happily help you out taking your dog out for a little bit of a pee or something like that so that's the good part about being an advantage you can put yourself into scenarios where people can help you I know the last time I hurt my back I couldn't even get into the drugstore to go grab anything so I found a nice lady that was walking into the to the store and I was like excuse me and I could barely stand outside I'm like can you can you maybe go grab me something for my back? And I gave her some money, she went in, she bought me some stuff for my back and I got back in my van. So it's pretty convenient that I can put myself in places where all the help and assistance you need is there. So like whether you're parking outside the hospital in a poor, in a poor medical condition, what a great place to park your home, you know? Um, I love that, that I got a chance to pull up here in front of the shop where I know everybody was around us here. People stopped by multiple times a day, brought us snacks and food and, good conversation and all the contractors came by and all asked questions right here at my on-site office slash home slash recovery center. It was it was actually quite enjoyable and moments like these, I'm thankful that I'm living, living the van life 100%. But I just wanted to update you guys on what's going on because this month has been the worst month in history for upload schedules for me. I've never missed this many videos in a row. Like I upload one and then boom, no videos for a while. And then I upload another one, boom, no videos for a while. Just wanted to give you guys a little something to let you know that we're doing okay over here. I'm doing my best to make myself feel better and hopefully get back to uh, making some videos, videos again soon. Anyway, you guys, hopefully you enjoyed this little video here today. Me and Cruz are gonna let you guys go. Um, I'll turn the camera on once the contractors and stuff are here and we'll see if maybe as the morning progresses, I get to be a bit more mobile. Please. I'm done sitting here. <laughs> Keep your double Vs up, you guys, and I'll see you on the next one.